Hey there, it's Pastor Eddie, and I thought I'd give you a short devotion this week. The ones that I offer this week, I'm going to have a little song for each of them that maybe you can sing along and keep your mind on things of the Lord. Our Bible verse this week for the first one comes from Isaiah 41, verse 10. It says, Do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your Lord. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous hand. What a great text. Let me read just a first part of the devotion here from the upper room. One morning on my walk to work, I saw a cute little bird walking on the pavement. I could not help slowing down to gaze at it. Then the bird started to walk toward the road, which was filled with buses and trucks. I was alarmed and blocked its way ahead. It flew a short distance and then continued walking toward the road. I quickly blocked it again. It tweeted, flew to a branch nearby, and it looked at me reproachfully. I was relieved that it had not been run over by a car, but that look of that bird reminded me that sometimes I can behave just like him. I complained to God sometime, asking why my ways have been blocked. But when I look back at those times, I realize that each obstacle has a purpose. <laughs> Now think about that for just a minute, dear friends, especially in this day and age we're living in right now. Uh, is there a purpose in the midst of this crazy uh, season of our lives? Can there be anything that shows God's amazing love? Ponder that just a minute. What is our purpose in the midst of this virus? I know for me, I'm spending more time in prayer. For me, I am um, spending more time Bible reading. I am in devotions. I'm seeking the Lord. I'm uh, having more quiet time, spending more time, honestly, early in the morning with my girls. And uh, we've talked through our devotions and we do an early morning walk, just trying to to take advantage, if I can say it that way, of the craziness around us. So that would be the key of the verse this time, for me at least. Um, is there a purpose even in the midst of this craziness? I'm reminded of Philippians 4.13. You all know that. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And you remember that little verse? I can do all things through Christ who sets me free. Sing it again. I can do all things through Christ who sets me free. I'd encourage you this week to sing that little melody. Also, don't forget, 8 o'clock Sunday morning, join us here on Facebook Live, and we will sing and share together about Christ who sets us free. Blessings.